Okay, so we read in the Action Bible, like bringing down the house, and also the chapter before that, the how his hair got cut, right? Um, a bad haircut. A bad haircut. Good job. Okay, so now we're gonna read. Hmm, I don't have an answer for that. <laughs> Okay, did you know? Sorry, that was my Alexa. Okay, God told Samson's parent that he was giving them a Alexa, son. Hold on. We did that talk to you. Shh. Sorry, I thought I heard my name. Okay, he was giving them a son to set, be set apart for him and that he wanted to use him to deliver Israel from the power of the Philistines. To show that Samson was set apart for God, his hair was never to be cut. God blessed Samson and gave him physical strength. Samson's parents were careful to obey what God commanded, but Samson was not. not. How? Okay, and Samson's story covered because four. Because he lied. He lied and he, he, he did he things that are not godly. Cool. And he did things that are not godly. He did not follow his vows. So Samson's story covered four chapters in Judges. And that's why we can't read it all today. So we use the Action Bible to just get a glimpse of it. Did God know the mistakes Samson would make when he chose him to be judge and deliverer? Yes. No. Yes. Yes. Why do you say yes? And why do you say because no? Because God can look at us. And then, God know everything. God know everything. How about you? Why do you say no, Novus? Because, because, and because Samson is bad. But God chose him anyway. So did God know that Samson uh, will do bad things? No. Yes, he does. He know everything. He is outside of time. He, he knows everything that we are going to do. Okay? But God chose Samson anyway because God knows that Samson will repent. That means he will be sorry for what he did at the end. Tell. Correct? Oh, what happened? Oh no. What are you doing? Correct, Novus? Oh, oh. Tell. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, let's trash that. <laughs> okay. okay, so we're gonna bigger. do 48 for that. So we're gonna do that's yes. Okay, so what did Delilah ask Samson? Justice 16. To tell her to don't write yet. Don't write yet. To tell. To tell her what they say. Yeah, the source of his strength. Okay. Okay, so Delilah. Delilah asked Samson to tell her the source of his strength Mommy. and how Mommy, he can, can be bound. Okay, not yet though. I'll sharpen it after we do this. But trying to so what happened to when he told her first. his secret? Trying to go in to finish first. No. Then She's not going to write right now. Then he will. He, and she write. Just a little bit. Then okay. he Then he 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 has gone to cut a cup. Yeah. Okay. So Judges sixteen twenty one, right? So when he told her his strength, then the Philistine seized him and gouged out his eyes, and then they brought him down to Gaza and restrained him with bronze chain, and he became a grinder in the prison. So right here, he 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 What's was hurt, grinder? right? Remember that windmill. The millstone that we saw in the picture, he has to grind the grain. So he has to walk around and around like an ox. Yeah. Where a grinder? Right here in the where, picture. Where, 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 okay. where? Let me see, let me see. Let me see if we can get a picture on here. No, I want the whole thing. Not yet. Bringing down the house. This is not bringing down the. Oh, this is together. Right here. This one. 
You see? So that, that, hold on. Chain him to a grindstone. So he has to push this thing around and around and around. That's what animals are used to do. And make him grind grain in the prison at Gaza. Is that hard? Untouched by his cap. No, it, it's, um, it's just, how? it's very, it's heavy. Uh, how come it's not moving around and around? Oh, because this is just a story. They animate, so it moves a little bit, but it actually needs to go around and around in a circle. Okay? He actually moves it and around. And how around. the, oh no. Mm -hmm. It's heavy. That, that's why they usually use animals to do well, it. Well, maybe it's harder for people? Yeah, it's harder for people to do that. Um, okay, you must so, push at people. Okay, yeah. so what happened when he told her his secret? He got hurt and had to grind. Grind what? Grind and became a grinder in prison. And became a grinder in prison. Okay? So that's what happened when you you um you like someone that is not godly. You see that novice? Yeah. Do you want to meet a a a wife or a girlfriend like Delilah? Uh, no. No, so she will hurt you. Right? Of uh, of uh, you you need when you grow up, you need a wife who can support you, who can who can help you? Can I marry daddy? No, daddy's mine. <laughs> um, so, that's a very hour. Yeah, he's your daddy, but my husband. And so you need to find a godly woman. Okay, no, I cannot find any. Well, how long? God, God will lead I know I'm here. Go to the godly. Husband club. Exactly. You need to find a godly husband. Do you want to find a person like Samson? No. No, right? He does not follow God. I know he, that. Even though, hold on. He, even though God blessed him, right? He did not use God's blessing for the glory of God. He wasted his, his years away. You don't want to find someone like that. Mommy, okay? mommy. Do you remember the story of Daniel? No. Daniel, the Daniel and the lion, right? How about Daniel? What do you think about Daniel? He is a godly. He is very godly. And remember, when the king told Daniel not to, not to, um, like bow down. I mean, the the king told Daniel to bow down to the statue. What did he do? He didn't. Then. And when he, the king told Daniel to pray, to like to not pray to God, what did he do? He prayed to God. Exactly. So he did things that honor God, right? He didn't do things that that bring disgrace to God. Correct. So Daniel or he did not. Now I think people like Daniel. Like godly people who who have high integrity, those are the people who will, will be a good husband to you. Can I marry? Can I go to the godly only godly husband club? Only? I don't think godly husband club exists, but um, but you're welcome to start one. But I don't know who I should marry. <coughs> God will bring you to that person if you love God. I do you, right. God. And it might be that God doesn't want you to marry. Okay? That's a possibility too. But if you marry, you need to marry someone who is godly. Okay? <laughs> Sit down, please. Okay. So when Samson got one more chance against the Philistine, who did he call on for help? God. God. Let's check our answer. 1628. We read those and the Bible. When Samson called to the Lord and said, Lord God, please remember me and please strengthen me just this time, O oh God, that I may take once I may at once take vengeance on the Philistines for my two eyes. 
So when Samson got one more chance, he called on God for help. Is it ever too late to admit and ask for God's forgiveness? No. Good answer. Good answer. Mommy, yuck. No. Mommy, yuck. Please don't do that. Okay. Okay, so right here. And then, what about you? We don't read that Samson worshiped false Canaanite gods, I mean idols, but we also don't see him worshiping the one true God who has set him apart to be a leader and deliverer for his people. Maybe Samson reasoned that his choices were, ah, uh, it's not that bad, but that's not good, okay? So think about the choices and effort you made this week and color the section you think described them. So spending time with God, was it not that bad, good enough, good or excellent? Okay, and then being honest. Excellent. How about doing your schoolwork? Excellent. Listening to your teacher. Excellent. Respecting your parents. Excellent. Your responsibilities at home. Excellent. So if you're, so you can color the part that you believe describe you. Excellent. Okay? Oh, excellent. Oh, excellent. Oh, excellent. And then ask God to help you make the wise choice. Okay? Excellent. Now, the memory verse. Do not, Do not conform to the pattern of their world, but be transformed to the renewing of your mind. By the Mommy, renewing of your mind. I, I Romans 12, 2. I know how to spell Unconformed. Yes, please spell it. S C O F R O M. C O N F O R M E D. Okay. So say it again and do the the um hand motion with mommy. Do not be conformed to the pattern of this world. Romans 12, 2. Uh -huh. There's Try a again. song about that. Oh, really? Okay, sing it's me the, the song. Church. In the every, church. every time we finish one worship, then it uh, uh, put Miss uh, uh, um, Regina or Brenda install it. Oh, I see. That's a good way to Do learn. Do not go forward to be Call. No, your <laughs> mind. Romans 12, 2. Good job. Okay. Bye.